Hi everyone, Peter here from Island Sewing Center with today's tip. Today's tip is for featherweight users. Today let's talk about a favorite among quilters, the Singer Featherweight Model 221. First introduced in 1933, it was billed as the perfect portable and has long since lived up to that name in portability, ease of use, and just plain cuteness. So you're happily sewing and you notice that your featherweight seems to be slowing down. You check the belt, that's okay. You check the threading, that's okay too. You even take time to lubricate your featherweight. What can it be? Well, having worked on hundreds of featherweights over the years, I've noticed that they have a tendency to snag thread in and around the hook assembly. First, remove the bobbin case and check underneath. Next, tip your machine on its back and look underneath. You'll find a small opening here. This is used in timing the machine but thread can get wrapped around the shaft, and as it gets tighter and thicker, it will actually slow down your machine. This can cause strain on the motor and uneven wear on your belt. If you see a thread buildup, stop using the machine and get in there with tweezers or a sharp hobby knife to cut and extract the thread. You'll be glad you did and your featherweight will go back to doing what it does best, giving you great stitch outs for a wonderful project. And that's today's tip. Remember that at Island Sewing Center you can count on honesty, great advice, outstanding service, and unequaled support. And don't forget to subscribe and press that little thumbs up button below if you found this tip helpful so we can bring you more. Have a great day.